If you often sense toxic relationships and absorb others' emotions, you must be an empath. This video explores empath's unique ability to detect and survive narcissistic relationships, offering guidance whether you're new to your empathic nature or have honed it for years. Lesson 1. Empaths trust their gut. Imagine you're an empath meeting someone new. You get a weird gut feeling that something's off about them, even though you can't pinpoint why. It is where trusting their gut comes in. Empaths rely on solid intuition, especially when dealing with tricky people like narcissists. Narcissists can be tough to spot because they can be charming and charismatic on the surface, but underneath, they might have some not-so-great intentions. When an empath feels that something's off about someone, it's like their internal alarm going off. They might not have proof, but they trust their instincts to protect themselves from harm. An empath's intuition is their first defense against narcissistic relationships. Lesson 2. Empaths recognize gaslighting. Narcissists excel at mind games, especially with a tactic called gaslighting. It's their go-to move, where they manipulate your perception of reality, making you doubt yourself, your memories, and your sanity. They insist, trust me, your recollection is wrong. For empaths, if you find yourself in constant self-doubt, that's a warning sign. It could mean you're in a relationship with a gaslighting narcissist. When you realize this, it's time to break free. Your instincts are saying, this isn't healthy. Recognizing gaslighting helps empaths navigate toxic relationships. Trust yourself and don't let anyone warp your reality. You deserve better. Lesson 3. Empaths Observe Narcissists' Lack of Empathy Picture an empath and a narcissist in a relationship. It's like mixing oil and water. Empaths instantly connect emotionally and promote understanding. They bend over backward for their partner. But it's a warning sign if their partner consistently ignores or brushes off their feelings. Empaths are empathy detectives. It's like a flashing red light when they notice someone they care about lacking empathy. It's their built-in empathy radar. So, when this happens in a relationship, empaths realize they might be dealing with a narcissist. That's their wake-up call. They know it's time to consider leaving for their well-being. Lesson 4. Empaths pay attention to the narcissist's love bombing. Love bombing is when someone overcompensates with affection and compliments to win you. Narcissists excel at making you feel special. While most people enjoy compliments and admiration, empaths get cautious if it feels exaggerated and insincere. Here's the twist. Narcissists crank up the love bombing when they mess up. They use it to reel you back after making a mistake, going way overboard with affection to distract from their errors. Empaths recognize this as a red flag in a relationship with a narcissist. Their ability to sense genuine emotions helps them spot something wrong allowing them to protect themselves from toxic relationships. Lesson 5. Empaths observe inconsistencies in narcissists' words and actions. Narcissists are slick liars who make big promises but often don't follow through. Empaths spot this when what the narcissist says doesn't match their actions. It's like being promised a dream vacation and ending up at home. That's a red flag for empaths. Once empaths realize they're getting played, they stop buying into the narcissist's lies. Empaths know they deserve better and plan their escape from the toxic relationship. It's like being a relationship detective, combining Sherlock Holmes' smarts with emotional intelligence to uncover the truth and seek healthier connections. Lesson 6. Empaths don't isolate themselves. Narcissists are usually self-centered and like to have control over their victims. They do this by trying to cut them off from their friends and family. It's like they want to create this bubble where they're the center of the universe. But empaths are too savvy regarding relationships. Once they realize what's going on, they won't let themselves get isolated. They know that having a support network of friends and family is super important, especially when things get tough. So. 
they'll make sure to maintain those social connections. They'll keep their friends and family close because they know these people can provide valuable support during difficult times. It's like having a safety net. Lesson 7. Empaths Remember Their Worth Narcissists act like emotional vampires, constantly trying to make their victims doubt themselves. They might say, you're not good enough, you're worthless. But empaths are different. They give themselves a pep talk, reminding themselves of their strengths, talents, and unique qualities. It's like their secret weapon against the narcissist's mind games. Empaths know they're already more than enough and don't need the narcissist's approval. This self-assuredness helps them stay strong and avoid getting sucked into the negativity. Lesson 8. Self-care is non-negotiable. Empaths can break free from toxic relationships with narcissists, realizing it's time to prioritize themselves. Self-care means giving themselves some much-needed TLC. It could be simple, like meditating for relaxation and clarity, or journaling to make sense of it all. Empaths also make time for their hobbies, finding joy and fulfillment. After surviving a narcissistic relationship, empaths learn to put themselves first. Self-care becomes their secret weapon for healing and moving forward more healthily. It's like recharging their emotional batteries and finding true happiness. Lesson 9. Empaths consider professional help. Suppose you're an empath stuck in a toxic relationship with a narcissist. In that case, it can mess with your mental and emotional well-being. It just doesn't work well. So what can you do? Well, one option is seeking professional help, like therapy or counseling. Therapists are like your emotional GPS in this messy situation. They help you figure out the tangled web of emotions and guide you toward healing. They're your trusty sidekicks in this superhero journey of surviving narcissistic relationships. What's remarkable is that empaths are often open to getting help because they recognize they've been through a lot of emotional turbulence due to narcissistic abuse. So they're humble enough to say, hey, I need some guidance here. And that's a super brave and wise move. Lesson 10. Empaths know when to walk away. Sometimes the best way to deal with a narcissistic partner is to say, I'm out of here. It's not always easy, but it can be the healthiest choice. When empaths finally break free from the grip of a narcissist, they start to realize something important. They know they deserve to be happy and have a loving, healthy relationship. It's like a light bulb moment when they realize they're worth more than what they've been getting in that toxic relationship. Once empaths decide to leave, they usually don't look back. They understand that returning to a narcissistic relationship won't bring them the happiness and love they deserve. So, it's a one-way ticket out of there. Remember, being an empath is indeed a superpower. It's a gift that allows you to connect with others profoundly, but also comes with its fair share of vulnerabilities. By embracing these strategies and learning to protect your well-being, you can harness your empathic abilities to lead a more balanced and fulfilling life. As we navigate the complex web of human interactions in today's world, understanding the dynamics between empaths and narcissists becomes increasingly relevant. In an era where social media often glorifies self-centeredness and personal image, narcissistic traits are seemingly on the rise. Empaths, with their heightened sensitivity and innate ability to connect with others on an emotional level, find themselves both drawn to and trapped by narcissists. This interplay between empaths and narcissists sheds light on broader societal issues related to empathy, mental health, and self-awareness. The topic also underscores the importance of mental and emotional well-being in our fast-paced, interconnected world. Empath superpower, their capacity to discern toxic relationships and protect their mental health, offers us valuable lessons. It encourages us to nurture our emotional intelligence, recognize the red flags of narcissistic behavior, and foster healthier, more empathetic connections in an age where genuine human connection can often feel elusive.
Watch another helpful video over here. If you enjoy psychology and empath related videos, you should subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video over here.